This is Mitchell who says, Pat, how can people lie and still be saved by grace? Uh, the Bible says that no liar is going to come into the kingdom of God. So if they're habitual liars, uh, you know, outside of the dogs and the yeah. adulterers and all who make a lie, the Bible is full of things about lying. And uh, you cannot really be a Christian and, and, and tell untruths, you know. So, I mean, you ask me, the Bible is very specific about that. So I wouldn't worry so much they're telling lies. But, uh, you know, it says you rebuke a fool and he'll hate you. You rebuke a, a wise man and he'll love you. But if, if the few, the, you rebuke a, a liar and, a, you know, he'll get mad because you catch him at it. But, you know, po politics these days is so full of lies it makes you sick. <laughs> That's true. You know, That's true. And, 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 and they get elected to high office and they're just a bunch of liars. And we don't like that. The Holy Spirit is the spirit of truth. God desires truth in the inner man. He wants us to be truthful and honesty. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father but by me. Do you have questions about God? Call us. It's toll free. 1-800-700-7000. Or check out this link.